Dear ladies and gentlemen, it is time again for a new episode of Yannick Asks. A pump that can be used globally in a wide variety of applications, how this is possible and what pump this is, you will find out in today's episode. Today I've invited another special guest in our studio and she's one of our product managers here at Velo, Kerstin Liegmann. Hello Kerstin. Hello, Yannick. Thanks for inviting me today. So, Kerstin, which products are in your portfolio at Velo? Well, first of all, thanks for giving me the opportunity to show you one of our new products. I'm product manager for um, end suction block pumps, which belong to the single stage dry runners. And I'm presenting you today our new Atmos Giga B range. Is the Atmos Giga B a complete new pump in our range? Well, it is the follow up range for our known Chrono Block BL. Ah, okay. Um, the Atmos stands for the basic level, right? Exactly, because it is a fixed speed pump. Above, we have our Jonas level, which are variable speed pumps with integrated frequency converter. Mm -hmm. And even above, we have our Stratus level, which are our premium pumps. This means now we renewed our basic range, which is now also according to the latest state of the art. I've heard that the Atmos Giga B is a real around talent. In which application it is typically used? We really have a wide range of applications where the pump can be used. We offer a wide range of components, for example, mechanical seals, where we can always offer the most suitable one for the requirement of the customer. And if you need to choose, what is the main use of mm -hmm. the pump? Well, the main use are heating, cooling and air conditioning systems in big commercial buildings. Dry runners always provide big flow, which you uh, typically need in air conditioning systems. And an example is a multi-story office building where the temperature needs to be constant all year long. So we talked about the field of applications, but as we know, there are also some challenges. Mm -hmm. Which are the main challenges, for example, for an operator of such an office building? First of all, you have a high level of operating costs in these kind of buildings. Mm -hmm. Energy costs are rising worldwide and keeping buildings cold in summer and warm in winter simply costs a lot of energy. Ah, okay. And we need pumps for these processes. Yes, pumps keep the systems running and their efficiency level is crucial. And if we go on, the second challenge for the operator is reliability. Mm -hmm. Because he needs to ensure that the temperature within the building is constant throughout the year. Mm -hmm. And if the air conditioning system breaks down in a hot summer, like the summers we had in the past, he really has a problem with his customers. So now we have two challenges, but all good things come in threes. The third one is uh, installation and maintenance costs. Mm -hmm. These are expensive that the operators of such an air conditioning system really like to keep low, especially on the heart of the system, which is the pump. So now we have three big challenges. But the important question is, how does the Atmos Giga B help to solve this challenge? Well, in summary, these are energy efficiency, robust pump design and easy maintenance. Three solutions for three challenges. So now let us take a look at these solutions in detail. Which solution is for which challenge? First of all, the Atmos Giga B was designed according to the latest state of the art. Mm -hmm. We have very few hydraulic losses uh, within the pump, which leads to a very high level of energy efficiency. And if we need to transport uh, high flow continuously throughout the year, every percentage point of hydraulic efficiency counts. Okay, so now we have the high efficiency. But what do you mean exactly with robust pump design? Well, we use very high quality components everywhere in the pump, which make it very reliable. First of all, we have the cataphoretic coating of all cast iron components, so we have less issues with corrosion. Mm -hmm. In addition, we have our I3 motors with a very strict motor specification, which is reflected in high quality ball bearings, for example. Another advantage was the easy maintenance. Can you explain this a little more in detail? Yes, of course. Well, as an option, all big four pole pumps above 37 kilowatt motor power are equipped with a so-called cartridge mechanical seal. Mm -hmm. You can imagine these pumps are really heavy. And uh, the advantage of the cartridge seal is that um, one installer can carry out the replacement of the seal without a crane or another lifting device in the technical room. You don't need to move the motor. And this saves time, equipment and operating expenses. Now we arrive at the topic of the service. And for this, we've invited another special guest in our studio. For the next few questions, we will change my talking partner. And now I can welcome Philip Beckmann out of the Server Solution team. Welcome, Philip. Hi, Yannick. It's great to be here. Philip, what do you think about our new Velo Atmos Giga B? I like it. 
In the service, one of our major topics is the system optimization. Okay. Old systems are energetically bad and have a much higher energy consumption. Mm -hmm. In the field of building management, more than two-thirds of operators are currently still using pumps that consume more energy than necessary. But a proactive exchange will have many advantages, right? Exactly. You save energy and costs and improve the sustainability balance of your buildings and systems. In addition, you keep your technology up to date at the same time. This will reduce the risk of a system failure and the maintenance costs. Philip, if we take a look at the spare parts, what about the spare parts supply of the Velo Atmos Giga B? A full range of spare parts makes the Atmos Giga B a very durable product. Mm -hmm. With our original Velo spare parts, we guarantee the highest quality as well as safe and trouble-free operation. Okay. In addition to its basic long-life design, there is a consistent supply of spare parts. In our spare parts catalog, you will find all the spare and wear parts you need for maintenance and maybe possible repairs. Philip, if we take a look at the scenario, if I buy the Atmos Giga B, how can I install it? We will happily accompany you throughout the commissioning process of our product and support you step by step. Mm -hmm. The optimal pump settings are essentially for energy consumption and therefore for the efficiency and operational reliability of the entire system. In this way, energy costs and pump wear can be significantly reduced. Hmm, and I heard that you also have the building service engineers on site. Yes, our commissioning also includes the instruction of the responsible building service engineers. Now we arrive at the end of the talk and Kerstin joins us back on stage. Yes, and due to the money information, I will try to summarize all these big facts. The Velo Atmos Giga B is a block type galanded pump for transporting water in a large number of building types. With this pump, we are also more energy efficient due to the few hydraulic losses with the new design. Also, the Velo Atmos Giga B is a very robust pump because every component has got a very high quality. Due to the cartridge mechanical seal, this pump also has big advantages for maintenance. With a look to Philip and the service team, the Vila Atmos Giga B will reduce failure and of course high maintenance costs. And last but not least, to install the pump, the service team can guide you step by step for the perfect installation. Wow, money information, but I think everything is in it. Does it fit to you too? Yes. Yes. Then, thank you very much for joining in and also for your explanation of our new Velo Atmos Giga B. And if you have now any other questions about the Velo Atmos Giga B, feel free to contact us. And now you know what I need to mention, so if you've done it yet, we would love and be happy to receive a follow or a free subscription on our YouTube channel. I will now thank all of you who joined in a week by week and we we'll see us soon with a new episode of Yannick Asks.